So, there I am, minding my own business in the executive lounge, thinking I'm just grabbing a snack. But nope, turns out my girlfriend's got a whole different menu in mind. You ever have that moment when your girlfriend plays CEO and you're just waiting for performance review? Yeah, this one involved less paperwork and more. Oral transactions. Let's just say she didn't exactly pull out any spreadsheets, but boy, there were definitely some spreads involved. She said she was testing my loyalty. Uh, sweetie, I think we skip right past the HR guidelines on that one. Laughter. And trust me, if this is what climbing the corporate ladder feels like, then I'll stay at entry level. Thank you very much. She got on her knees, right? And I thought, finally, someone's taking my career advice seriously. Turns out the only job she had in mind was definitely outside of corporate policy. At one point, I hear a knock outside the lounge and I'm like, oh God, is this how I die? With my pants down in the executive lounge. I mean, forget about a raise. I'm about to get terminated. She's whispering all these things about power and dominance. And I'm thinking, is she trying to negotiate a promotion or just see if I can hold my breath for a record-breaking three minutes? And guys, there's always that one awkward moment when your brain goes, should I say something sexy back? But instead, all I can think of is, so, uh... How's the quarterly revenue looking, boss? In the end, I didn't get the job. I mean, obviously, but who knew corporate life came with such perks? Maybe next time, I'll negotiate for a corner office with soundproof walls. Thanks, everybody. Like, comment, subscribe, and share, but uh, not with HR, okay?